what's up, what's up? This is the mochis. We are in Inglewood and we are at Veronica's Kitchen. First time eating African food. We're excited to try it out. Um, this place blew up on TikTok, so let's see what it's all about. All right, let's see what the hype is about. Hello, hello, guys. I'm kind of excited. Um, okay, so let's see. So first timer, they have a recommendation for Xri and Joe Loaf rice. Um, so we're probably gonna get the X3 pounded yam with beef and also we're gonna get jollof rice with chicken and also have a vegetarian option too so that's kind of cool so I got the Guinness uh, it's non-alcoholic beverage it's from Jamaica and I never had it before so you know I have to try it I got a diet coke it's really hot <laughs> it is hot in here Cheers. All right, cheers for today. Whoa. Tastes like Guinness <laughs> with sugar. <laughs> really? I already don't think I'm gonna like it. I don't like Guinness, so. Huh, this is like very interesting. Never had this kind of taste before. Um, it's really like Guinness with sugar and it's very interesting. Want to try this? Sure. I'm a little bit scared. <laughs> it's not that bad. Oh, interesting. What? It's like... That's not what I thought at all. I thought it was going to taste like really bitter, like Guinness beer. But it kind of tastes like candy, like molasses candy. Like a sweet candy with a slight bitter taste, but it's not bad. So we just finished ordering our food. Um, this is our first time ever trying Nigerian food. And I heard of this place because of TikTok. I heard this from her. <laughs> <laughs> and then I watched on YouTube. And uh, I was like, oh, wow, I've never seen those kind of food before. So I want to try it out. And uh, they're known for the fufu, which is like pounding yam. It's like a white ball. So it's very soft. And you're supposed to scoop it with the soup and eat it together with meat or vegetarian options. Yeah, I'm excited to try it. I'm a little bit nervous because I've never tried anything like this before. It's no. like totally out of our comfort zone, but... It, it is. We never come here. It's, it's located in Inglewood, which is uh, uh, LA. Whoa. Whoa, so we just got the food right now. It looks it's crazy. It smells uh, so good. So we got this. This egg suey with uh, beef. And this is the pounded yam. Oh, it is hot. Uh, fufu. Fufu, yeah. So I'm excited to try it. Let's try this out. <laughs> it kind of feels like mochi. It's soft. <laughs> Whoa. Let's try the egg suey. Sure. Like you see, so I think it's this one right here. It's super hot. You can see it like already steaming. Okay. You got with this with beef, by the way. Yes. Oh my gosh, this like is really tender. It like melts off. Wow. It's already like falling apart. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm, like a little bit nervous. I don't know how to eat this. Are you ready? Uh, cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh wow, oh wow, this is really good. It has a lot of different flavors, like spicy. Oh my God. Wow, it's really spicy, but it's really good. Mm. Ooh, it has like a kick to it. Mm. I wonder if there's like egg in here. I don't know. Mm, it does have eggs. It's really good. It's like egg with spinach? Mm-hmm. I want to try it with the fufu now. Mm. I think you're supposed to like just use it like a bread. Dip it in a soup, I think. Oh. I've seen what people do in it. Okay, cheers. cheers. Mm. Oh, I didn't expect that at all. It tastes like potato. Mm. 
I thought it was going to be like rice, but I think this is... Yeah, it's kind of like a mashed potato. It is like a mashed potato. Oh, this is really good. I don't know how to eat this, but I'm just going to eat it. Mm. I did not expect this kind of taste. No, it's very flavorful. The mm. stew is very um, comforting. Yes. When you guys come here, definitely get this. They got beef, but some people say um, goat is good too. Probably one of the best juice I've ever had. It's so weird that I'm eating it like this. <laughs> so this is uh, stewed chicken? Yes. Um, it's red, so I don't know if it's spicy or not, but it looks delicious. I'm like not really good with spicy, so I'm a little bit scared right now. <laughs> Let's give it a go. Yeah. Oh, this is fried. Oh, it is? Yeah, it's fried chicken. Oh, wow. It's fried and then it's dipped in a sauce, I think. Yes. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Wow. It's uh, very different. I never had fried chicken dipped stew. in stew. I'm very shocked. It's very crunchy. Mm. It has a little kick to it. Mm. Tomato base stew. <coughs> oh. oh, that was spicy. I'm not good with spicy either, but. I also give this dish like a 10 out of 10. Yeah, it was good. a lot of flavors. It was really good, holy shit. I don't know, this stuff goes good with everything. So good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we got another dish, right? That comes with the uh, chicken stew. So we got the rice. Rice with plantains. Fried uh, banana, right? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try it on. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Okay, this is kind of a lot, but. <laughs> Mm. Tastes like Mexican rice. Mm -hmm. Is that what it is? Tastes like? It's like a tomato bell pepper tasting rice. I noticed all the food has a little kick to it. Mm -hmm. Bro, this is good. It's a little spicy for me, but it's good. Oh, it's spicy for you? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try it with a plantain. It's not too bad. It's probably like even out the spiciness with sweetness. Yeah, it tastes good together. So the plantain and the rice together taste good. Separate, I don't like it, but together it's good. Oh, I'm digging this rice and I'm sweating. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm actually quite impressed. I had no expectations. Wow, it was good. Oh, we're so stoked, so uh, we're just about to wrap it up, um, but just final thoughts, uh, this place is really bomb. It was tasty, I never had this kind of food before and uh, it was a good experience for sure. Yeah, the fufu was so fun to eat with, it's like a mochi and potato at the same time and you dip it in the soup and everything was super flavorful. I would definitely be back. I give them a 10 out of 10. Love it. Oh, for sure, I'll come back here again. And um, I give 10 out of 10. This place was good. And um, I'm down for trying more new stuff, I guess. Yeah, I did not expect... We did not expect... Like, we had no expectations coming in. Um, but it, everything was very satisfying. It was really good. 
guys are in the Anglewood area, uh, please feel free to check this place out. It's called Veronica's Kitchen. Really small hole-in-the-wall place, kind of tucked in the corner of the street. But the food is super delicious. So if you guys are in the area, definitely stop by. You would not regret it. And also, if you guys like the video, please comment, please subscribe, and put the like button. And um, yeah, we let try us, oh yeah, yeah. Let us ahead. know where else you guys like to eat. Uh, yes. you, where else you guys would like to recommend us to try out? We'd love to try it out. We love your recommendations. And uh, we would drive hours for <laughs> just for food. So let us know. Cool. Sounds good. Well, we'll see you guys in the next video. Hope you enjoyed this one. Bye bye. Bye.